Hello and welcome back to our Confederate campaign. Okay, I've built out our first core uh, just about as much as we could. So we've got a full 20 brigades of varying quality, so the 4th Division isn't great at all. Um, I've got quite a few batteries of artillery, but they're really not as strong as I'd like them to be. And it was basically whatever guns we had available uh, we used. So that's pretty much like the real Confederate Army. Okay, so we're going to go into the Battle of Shiloh. Okay, thank you very much. Right, so let's start. And I think this will be quite a challenge. Okay, so uh, our army, we don't have enough information about the size of the Federal Army. Um, so here we go, coming in. Let's start. Yes, yes. Pittsburgh Landing. Right, I think we've all seen this before, so let's just skip that. So, the initial part of the attack here. Right, next. Scroll faster, damn you. Right, Shiloh Church. Yep. Yep. Okay, let's just... Oh no, we're already paused. Right, what do I want to take? Right, so... Uh, I'll get my army in. Right, no... Ah, do I want the artillery at this point? Probably not, actually. Um, if I drop that... Um, right, let me get the troops in position and I'll explain... What I'm going to do, because I'm going to play this differently to the ways I've played Shiloh before. Or at least that's the theory. Right, we've got two more brigades. Sharpshooters, hmm. Right, we'll take Bib. Uh, Bulk is quite weak, and we'll take him, whoever he was, Blakely. Right, okay, dokie. So, we know we have to capture Shiloh Church. Now, normally the way I've played this in the past is to come over this flank, come in through here, very nice, worked a treat. But my concern isn't this stage of the battle, it's later, it's Pittsburgh landing itself. So, we need to get our forces as far up here as possible for the next stage of the battle. So, um, that's why I'm sort of angling in this direction. Um, yes. Okay, let's go. Right, pause. Right, so we're looking at advancing that road and that road. Okay, so Appling, Baldwin, Bib, Blakely, uh, Bacon that way please. And you boys up this way. Right, and I will, from some of our weaker units, Bib, congratulations, detach skirmishers. Uh, um, uh, really possibly should be our bigger units to detach skirmishers from. Hmm, okay, worth considering. Right, go! General, get back. Appling. And your skirmishers, please engage. Gosh, they're close. Right. right. Okay, we're forcing them back. That's good. Right, I need some flank security over here. Get over there, please. Right. So we're aiming at attacking round about here and then pivoting up here as much as we can. Right. Keep going. Okay, Appling, Bartle. Okay. 
Now, of course, Army's going to be quite tired after doing this, but that's unfortunate, but the way it's got to be. a second. You boys go there. Um, all the units, incidentally, if, you, if I hadn't mentioned before after, this is what I'm going to call the Georgia Corps. So they're all counties in the state of Georgia. And my favourite is Ben Hill County. So this is the Ben Hill Brigade, which is a fantastic name. I like that. Um, what I'll probably do with my other corps is name them after other uh, southern states. Um, I'm just doing this alphabetically. Maybe I'll choose a bit more exciting names for the other core. But we'll see how we get on. Okay. Going. Uh, if I just fall back, fall back. So we're not getting much in this flank. Okay, Ben Hill, your flank security. Right. So just advance you up to there. You watch our flank. So well, Atkinson. Well, Banks. That flank. Right. Right. Okay, so we've got skirmishers over there, Beb Holt. Bit optimistic with the shooting there, I think, lads, but never mind. Right, we'll keep everyone in cover if we can. Or well, the main body advance. Oh, good shot there, Ben Hill. Good shot, gentlemen. Your general is pre pleased. Right, okay, so we've got two Federal Brigades here. The second attack wave. Okay, so this is more of my artillery. Hmm. I forgot there was the second attack wave, so let's just pause and get everybody moving. Right, so get you all up to here. To here. Cavalry just luck around there so we don't get flanked. Everyone else up in this direction. Right. Please. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. Uh, ammo. Right. So, we want to flank Hildebrand. I know there'll be artillery up there. So... Just move up a smidgey. Keep ourselves still in cover. Right. Okay, so. Don't think these defensive positions will give them much. But we'll see. Right. Yeah, so that's the artillery opening up, obviously. Right, so let's see if I can get Hildebrand out of that position. That 
That's looking good. That's looking very good. Okay, got cavalry coming up. That should not be a problem. So, we can force away Hildebrand, then we'll get into Peabody's flank and fat, and just stop everyone. So Appling can one hit Peabody in the flank. Like Peabody will go and then it's up here. Better just hold. Right, we're chopping up that cavalry very nicely. Let's get for the other. Infantry and the guns are coming up, or the reserve infantry, I should say. Yeah, Peabody's getting hit quite nicely. How are we doing? Yeah, doing very well. Right. Baldwin, move up. Fantastic. Well done, well done. Now you move up to there. You boys up. The skirmishers up there as well. Blakely move up as well. Good. Guns, come on. Right, now we know the Federals are going to get some reinforcements, so getting this sort of line I think will be very useful. And of course we need to remember about the actual church itself, and that we need to capture that. Right. Baldwin, get rid of the skirmishers. Excellent. Guns up. Slight help round here. Baker, come on. Butts. Right. So we want to hit Peabody again if we can. Hill around, move the rifles around, I'll keep the cavalry just scouting over here. Right. Halt! Fall back! Halt! Right, driven off Buckland, that's fantastic. Okay, right, you boys. Could you just run for me? That would be very handy.
guns. I think I'll need to bring you up a wee bit eh, to help. Right, so the key is Peabody. If I can shift him. Excellent. And do as much damage to the rest of the Federal Force as possible. Everybody shoot there. Right, ammo. How are you doing, Bacon? You're doing okay. Over. Of a smidgy. Right. Okay. So a little bit behind schedule, I think. Hildebrand's gonna go. Right, more cavalry. Okay. Seems very silly, horses. So the federal troops are coming down this way, that's alright. Right, Appling Halt. Right, so Wraith I think will be a wee bit of a problem. But if the federals come down that way, that's absolutely fine. I think Peabody's won't be around much. Getting good shots in at that artillery, so that's fantastic. There goes Peabody. Right. Fantastic. Okay, so. Bowen Bacon form up along here. You boys are going to have to run for me. Get the guns up. Reserves up. Guns up. Okay. Uh, ammunition. Right. Pause, get this right. Keep bib. Bacon to there. Right, skirmishers coming up. Guns coming up. And reserves coming up. And ammunition to the front line. Right. Who are you? We've got a charge coming in there, that's not a problem. Right. Get Ben Hill down there as well. Banks, you back up there. Right, so we've driven off that auxiliary. 
Peabody is gone. Bacon. Oh no. That angle, sir, that angle. These guys up. They're quite inexperienced units, so they may not like having their flank. Exposed. I think Wraith is not long to stay in the battle. That's good. Halt. Marsh to make sure we capture the flag. So we've driven off Wraith. Fantastic, we've got the church. We've got charges coming in, but we have plenty of supporting troops. No, 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 no. Don't need to run. Okay, it's the same idea here. It's all about um, getting up to Pittsburgh Landing. Now, up there is quite clear, but if I stick on this side, I should ha be able to have both sides of my army supporting each other instead of splitting them up to go up here. So, our aim is to go up this way. Right, okay, we'll skip. We know what's happening. Uh... And this is Bragg's corps, so these are not our troops. Okay, right. Skirmish out, please. Uh, Anderson, Bragg, Gibson. We are going to get more reinforcements, so this isn't a full force. Jenkins, go over there, please. Right. Bragg, don't get too far ahead. Right, so I want to overload here and be able to advance. The Hornet's Nest will be about there. Uh, well, yeah, yeah there ish. Or Chalmers, you move up and support. Gladden as well. Uh, guns. Right. Okay, so we've got fairly weak federal forces here. Should be able to knock them off okay. Up, what are you? Uh, smooth boards, okay. What are you? Howitzers, okay. Pond, get somebody off to the flank, please. Right, right, I want to hold back until the guns are in position. Okay, silly cavalry, if you're charging us, that's fantastic. Oh, 
Okay. So we're driving these guys off. Skirmishers. Brag, come up. Jackson. Okay. don't want to go too far here um, just being able to expose this unit that cavalry is quite excitable isn't it ok Anderson get up there Shammer's up to there you can run a little bit for me There, get rid of the guns. Okay. All right, Alan's going to go. Alan has gone. That's excellent. Right. Okay, we've got us now. Normally. I would send the reserve corps over to here, but not in this one. This is plan B. Just get some cavalry over there to screen us. With guns. More guns. American Ridge. Right, okay, we'll come back to that. Okay, fantastic. Charmers deal with that. Jackson deal with them. Guns, fantastic. Right. Jackson, move up. Skirmishers, get back, get back. Right, so we've got some guys over there. That's fine. Right, so we've got some federal brigades there. Don't care. Alright, so we're now at sort of edge of the map here. We want to still keep doing damage if we can. Gladden. do is move the guns up. Gibson, bullets, drag. It's fine. Jenkins, you just stay there. Who are you? You are a very silly piece of artillery. Could you please move over that way? I want you on that road. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay, so we'll form up on this sort of line. You there. I don't really want to engage, but it's just to get our artillery round to here. Right. Okay, so we're doing a lot of damage the federal forces, that's exactly what we need. Okay, just yes, stop there. Right. 
hoping that artillery will get out. Right, let's get you, you know, up the road. There we go, that's close enough ish. Right. And if they want to charge us, then that's absolutely fine. Guys in support. Shadow Church is at risk. No, it isn't. Right, okay. Right, let's pause. So we just need to hold Shadow Church. I don't think that's going to be a problem. Right, so got our forces here. Buckley Force that way. You shoot at them in the side. Bacon, get round there. Get these brigades up further. That's good. Guns into position. Uh, ammunition. Uh, more guns up. Uh, Brian, I'll move you over there actually to cover that. Horses are quite fine there. Right, so we just need to drive off this counter attack. up a bit. Ben Hill moved to support. Guns there. Right. Okay, so teensy bit of a problem there. isn't going as well as I hoped. Not going to lie. No, Brian, move back, move back, move back. Move back. Right. Okay, so should be able to... Okay, shoot General Grant. Go too far. In fact, no, just stay with your barrel. Horses get round. Right, so we're doing good damage to them there. But if you can come down and get his artillery. Lovely. Okay, so this northern part of the army has been dealt with severely. Bit more problem here. Get into his artillery. Oh, wow. Should be able to get in behind them. No, that's only temporary. Right, because we're behind them here. guys get into the artillery do damage bacon come down open right now this is interesting right that's a hornet's nest so that's what I was trying to get to to get past here and go on and I've got units in good position but I think we'll have to leave it here um, let's see how we get on 
Ooh, bit nervous, bit nervous. But uh, as usual, thank you for watching and join me next time.